Trigger. It's going to be one of those sorts of days today, and I am on the beautiful Hayling Island. And what a glorious day it is! Um, we've got the Airflow Exceed, large arbor, 9 11 weight, Hardy Pro, Actri Pro Axis Intrix, uh, 10 weight, 9 10 weight, on there. Uh, going to be using a little surface popper with a uh, little bait fish uh, shrimp pattern behind it. And we'll be working all these uh, groins you see behind me. Like that one there. And uh, just working it close to structure. Intermittent retrieves, sharp retrieves, a little bit slow retrieves. And uh, I think we should have a few. Got my fly vest with me bits and bobs here, my uh, chest cam. So, uh, I think first one's going to be, well, why don't I start here? Start on this one. And then there's a nice big old groin there in the background. So, let's go get him. So, I've just got my uh, rock shoes on, shorts. No need for waders when the weather's like this. Get amongst it, feels even better when you're in the uh, fish's element catching them. The bass will be just um, hanging close to the structure really. And uh, I'll just be working the fly around. The beauty with the fly rod is you can just control it so well. You can uh, drop the uh, stinger fly down in amongst the boulders and use the popper to just hang above it. This is a, a weight forward. Um, it's actually a floating um, weight forward line. Oh yeah, let's give it give it a go. We love it, love the line. It's gonna weigh it out slightly. It's nice here because the current's just working round off the end. Get a bit of line out. Get up on these rocks a bit. That's better. So to follow off one little schoolie. Sit. 
There they are. They're just a bit further out now. Over there. Yeah, there they are. I can see them hitting stuff. Come on, get it out there. There they are, just off the front of the shore they are, hitting stuff. It's moving into position a bit better, I think. Good. Sweet two shot. Two. That's the beauty of a stinger in a. Uh... Tornado. Fun. See some nice big ones. Oh, yeah. In again. It's almost. <laughs> uh, well, what fun we had. They don't always have to be big. He smashed that surface popper. Still there. We're definitely working some sort of shoulder bait fish. I actually saw that one come up for it. Yeah, I'm in. Oh, no, I missed it. Another one! And again.
like of that popper. There you go. Curtis! I mean, there must be millions of them out there. Smallest one yet. It's a little spotty that one. Beautiful. Good to see the uh, populations of little bass are good. A little tiny one. Such great fun though. 
Inhale that. Little tiny one. Yours is a bit bigger than mine. It's just on that little uh, shrimp pattern. Well, that was fun. It's always uh, nice just to have a good fun session. There's a lot to be said for specimen hunting and uh, setting out your stall for the big stuff, but just to go out and have fun on the on the fly rod is uh, it just makes you happy. Very versatile again, as I say, and uh, so lightweight, just a vest and a rod and a reel. You know, to move from mark to mark, it's uh, very, very enjoyable. And they were all small ones today, um, but what brilliant sport. And when you get a big one on the fly rod, uh, yeah, it really is something else. So I'm going to uh, carry on on a few different spots, see if we can get a few more. Hopefully something a bit bigger.